base. And thanks to Playmate Toys, we got our hands on a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles WWE Ninja Superstars. And if you look to my right, your left, you'll see we have Raphael as Sting. That's right. The iconic black and red Sting from his Tyrants of the Wolf pack. Packaging is pretty massive for a Turtles package. And I mean, really, this Raphael is... He's pretty big for a Turtles figure. And I think that's cool with the packaging special. It's over the top because he is a wrestler. So the front of the package, you see this awesome window box display showing Raphael and all his gimmick and his Sting makeup. And uh, of course you got the WWE logo, the title of the line, the Ninja Superstars, and a picture of Sting. As you see, we got Sting here with the white and black makeup. Very similar. He's not rocking the red and black scorpion shirt, but we'll let that go. On the side, you got a picture of Raphael. And on the back is other toys in the line. You got John Cena with Leonardo, Michelangelo as Macho Man, and Donnie as The Undertaker. So, let's take this guy out and see how cool this figure actually is. There's Raphael as Sting. So, let's look at the likeness. You can see the makeup. And I like how they put the makeup going through his bandana. Right? And it's really cool. The Stinger shirt. And of course he's going to have his his uh, belt around him. He's got the black pants. And even, you see he's got the little boots. So he's got laces on his boots. I don't know how that comes up on camera. And he's got the receding hairline. How awesome is that? And of course he's got Sting's iconic bat. So you can do that. I'm going to punch you in the face with this baseball bat. Alright, so let's break down a bit of the articulation here. So, you'll notice the head, full rotation. Look up, down, all around. Arms, shoulder, has a great joint. He's got a decent elbow joint, and he even has a wrist joint. And that's a diagonal for this one. He has good leg motion. He has a swivel and a bend. I took the feet to the feet to right in. The feet are static. But that's a pretty good amount of articulation for a turtle figure. The only thing that's a little odd is the uh, baseball bat. Does it hold as. There we go. You gotta get it like that. There it will. Holds a lot better. It's a soft, pliable bat. But it holds really well like that. He probably stole it from Casey Jones. <laughs> and uh, we'll take that out for a second. He's, you can see how uh, pliable it is like that. Great man of rubber. He's got the kendo stick, which will, will fit perfectly in his hand. Actually, that fits really nice. And I think that looks really cool for Raphael. And he has a Mutant's Rule garbage can lid. Then let me put that in his hand, right on this side. And now he's ready for war. He's ready for Hulk Hogan to come out so he can beat him up. And that's pretty cool. I love how the collar is slightly turned up on the on the on the on the coat. And it looks good. I think it looks really nice. Uh the figure looks great. The figure is sturdy, man. This is a heavy, heavy duty turtle figure. I don't know how well it picks up, but it's hard to tell like by looking at it, but it's a heavy figure. Super heavy figure. And the weapons are awesome, I think. And even though I'm not the biggest Sting fan, uh, I can't hate this figure whatsoever. He's got to be the biggest turtle figure I have in my collection, so that is really cool. I well, I love the idea. Um, I would love to get my hands on Donatello as Undertaker. That's my, one of my favorite wrestlers of all time. But this one's cool, man. I think this is really cool. It really works well. I like the tape around the wrist and the fingers. There's nothing about this that doesn't look so cool. All right, I have to thank Playmates for sending us the review sample. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Thank you so much for watching. It's a new year. It's a new time. And we have awesome figures like this. Turtles over the years always did crossovers. They've done Universal Monsters. They've done sports figures. They've done all things like this. But to get an official license with the WWE to do guys like Undertaker and Sting and Macho Man and John Cena, it makes perfect sense. <laughs> it just... Right up to Turtles Alley because they're teenagers. Why wouldn't they want to be cosplaying as wrestlers? <laughs> I think that's awesome. All right, guys. I want to thank Playmates once again. Guys, they're your toys. Play with them the way you want. And thank you so much for watching.